Good morning, good morning, good morning, you lovely lot on this chilly Tuesday morning. Blue sky, but oh my goodness, that's cold out there. I have just done the school run, dropped all the kids off at school, and my eyes are sore because they were watering so much from the cold air. Um, the sun's gorgeous, but the cold is biting out there. So I did originally want to go for a walk with Virginia around the green and the village and maybe stop at the park or what have you this morning with the kids, but not when it's this cold. They'll just be miserable. Excuse me. And that'll make my life miserable. So we'll do stuff here uh, this morning and hopefully it'll warm up and we can do the park later. I'm going to make myself a nice cup of tea and I'm going to sit down for five minutes and enjoy that before the next lot of kids descend at nine o'clock. Finn's having a grown up moment, aren't you, Finn? Yeah. It's not things that the little ones can play with. It's got little pieces. So you're doing it at the table. That's it. Where's the hole for that one? Good job. Making a butterfly. Are you doing an egg and spoon race with your mouth, Aussie? That's clever. What are you scooping? Are you going to do it, Harrison? Can I carry an egg? Did you have a nice holiday, Harrison? Oh, you're going to copy oh. Aussie. This is how germs are spread. Oh. <laughs> egg and spoon race. Uh, where did the ball go? You have to turn it up like that and it will come out somewhere. There it is. Then you have to... Oh, it's gone back in again. Give it a wriggle this way. Woo. That's it. Try not to get it in the hole. And Orion's playing with the... What have you got here? Camper van. And dinosaur Orion. Where's your dinosaur? That's it. Good boy. And what have you got? Dinosaur bones? You got dinosaur bone? Been fossil hunting. Oh, dinosaur's on the chair. Is he having some dinner? I know. Yeah, you can use that one if you like, Harrison. We missed you last week, Harrison. Yeah. Yeah. Tractor. That's for Harrison to play with Orion. Good boy. We'll do some digging. Do some digging. Oh, is it hot, Ozzy? What you cooked for me? Oh, that looks tasty. Hot. All topped off with a cupcake. Hot. Hot, is it? Hot. Shall I clear this to the side? There you are. Put it on the mat there. That'll, that'll be all right then. Then you won't burn the side if it's hot. Bye. Good boy. Bye. Don't burn your fingers. That's coming along really well, Finn. You're doing its antennae. Very good. Is it? Is it not quite? Tell you what, we you just give that a wriggle like that. Is that what you want to do? So it's in the right place. There you go. That's really good. You're making a butterfly. What's next? Another little red thing, maybe. I found one. There you go. That's a creative thing. How are we doing? Oh, you need a tissue, mister. Mm. He's frying eggs, aren't you, Ozzy? You frying eggs? I've got eggs. You've got eggs. Is that the egg? Well, it is nearly Easter. Egg? Chick, 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 chicken, lay a little egg for me. Yeah. Chick, yeah. chick, 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 chicken, yeah. I want one for my tea. Did we get the chicken nest out? Oh, look, Orion's found where the chicken egg comes from. That's a cockerel, though, Orion. That's a man chicken. They don't lay eggs, but good guess. This is the lady chicken. She's called a hen. Yeah. Oh, a bowl, yeah. We've got lots of bowls already. Oh, hi, chicken. This is the hen, and she lays the eggs. Oh, yeah, don't let her peck you. Peck, peck, peck. Where's the egg? Oh, she laid one! <gasps> Yay! The chicken laid an egg! Okay. You go feed the chicken? Hey, mommy. Why don't you walk round, boys? Walk round, Harris, um, Orion. 
Come on, walk around to Ryan, that's it. Bok, 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 bok. Food. Food, there you go, she likes Nelly. lettuce. Oh, are you feeding the cockerel? Nom, mm, yum, 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 yum. Bok, 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 bok. Chicken. 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 Oh no, is it chicken? That's her crest on the top of her head. Dada, oh no, it's a chicken. It's a chicken. Rosie the hen went for a walk. Rosie the hen went for a walk. is chasing so she's not noticed the fox rosie's just walking along and what's going to happen to the fox <gasps> someone's left a rake on the floor shall we see oh he landed on it and it's popped him on the nose yeah we'll do that one in a minute and rosie's not even noticed <laughs> she's just walking along oh no it couldn't hold his weight could it he fell inside the haystack and she's just walking along. The goat. Yeah. The goat track. Goat doesn't seem bothered, does he? Past the mill. A goat. Yeah. Oh, beaver. Beaver. Oh, look, she's got a leg caught on this little bit of string. Yeah. Yeah, and there's the flower. Can you see? On a hook. On the windmill. Just been milled. The foxes think they're going to get her. Oh, but because the string look got caught on her foot. Look, it unraveled. And he got covered in flour. Uh-oh. He's not having a very good day, is he? He's not going to get that chicken. Whoa! Crash. Yellow. Should we turn it around a bit? What about a pinky colour? Look on there. Oh, it's purple. Purple. Look at that, a boy. Can we do some more? Okay. Oh, one, two. Purple. I've been reblondified. Mm. And I'm having some fruit. Mmm, berries and evaporated milk. You'll have to excuse my um, my panda eyes. I washed my hair after having the bleach put in it and I uh, ended up with water running down my face and I haven't dealt with it. But yes, I feel much better now having been blondified. Um, it's getting quite late now, so I'm going to make tea for the family and then I'm going to help Kenzie get his stuff ready for his exam tomorrow. He's got a big three hour cooking exam tomorrow. I have enjoyed being the guinea pig. Oops, the guinea pig for what he's been cooking. So that's a benefit. But it would be nice to just have the exam out of the way. Um, I've also got parcels from the... Ukraine support wish list, which I haven't, I've opened them so I can see what they are. And I meant to sit down and actually say, this is what we've got and who it's from, thank you. But that's gonna to have to wait till tomorrow now because it's it's getting late and I really want a cup of tea and to sit down with Lee for a bit before um, before it gets too late in the evening and we all get too sleepy. I want to have a you know chit chat with my man. Um, so I'll do that tomorrow, but thank you very much for those of you who have sent them. I know that one of those parcels is from Minxie, Minx Laura 123, because she bought things and then sent them to me separately because she knows my address. Um, so that package I know is from her. Um, so I need to open that up. Um, and I just want to say to her, I hope she gets better soon because she's come down with COVID. She's avoided it all this time and now she's caught it and is feeling pretty rubbish and sorry for herself. So poor Minxie, I'm sorry. I wish I could make it better for you.
I think a lot of people kind of under the impression that COVID is gone. You know, it's like, oh, well, we're not doing this anymore, we're not doing that anymore, and it's gone. I'm not saying Laura, you know, thought that, but I think a lot of people do think that. And I know Laura was one of those that still wore masks and what have you. But yeah, you know, we're all mixing and everything now, and it's, we might not be testing for it, so it might look like the levels are going down, but it's still there, we're just not picking it up. And um, I guess unless you get really poorly, it won't get picked up. It, you know, end up being like anything else that we have to live with bug wise, but it's still there and it's still making people feel pretty rubbish and it's still making some people very poorly. So I hope she, you know, recovers quite quickly and doesn't have any long lasting effects. Kenzie seems much better today. And, you know, like I've said, I don't know whether it was COVID that has left him getting poorly every other week with some sort of cold or whether it is just that we're mixing again and therefore he's picking bugs up naturally because his immunity is low because we've been sort of not mixing for two years and now we are mixing that the immunity um, has got to build up again and I suspect that is the case but you do worry that maybe there's some lasting effect from the Covid especially as he was somebody who had um, asthma and stuff beforehand. Right, I am going to finish this. I'm going to stop waffling and I'm going to see you lovely lot tomorrow. Thanks for watching.